breathing sucks right now. Last water for a while here, and this is it. I've already filtered like a liter and a half, but I'm gonna bring an extra liter with me because Five miles down and uh, just took a little break it's starting to heat up this uh, this whole section is really exposed um, I mean the past couple sections have been but man this view is gorgeous absolutely gorgeous soon today I'm gonna be hitting the high point on the entire CT um, which is like 13,400 or something like that. Um, there are 14,000 footers off the CT, just like the San Luis Peak that I almost did a couple days back. But um, man, I have enough trouble breathing at 13,000 foot. Maybe I'll like I'll spend a couple days in Durango and try to go hit a 14, but it's not really not on my radar. It's not something I came out here like needing to do. Um, my whole thing is, I just wanted to through hike this trail, man. You know, I live in Hawaii, I live at sea level. So me hiking 13,000 foot mountains, that's a feat for me. This is the beginning of the climb up to the high point of the CT. All right, so I think, I think that over there is the high point. And I'll be up there in an hour or more. <laughs> get up this thing and this is not the high point this is just a little hill <laughs> uh. oh the sun is hot hey, I just got to show you this valley man because wow look at that that actually reminds me a little bit of Waimea Canyon in Hawaii just the vastness of it just take that in for a second here let me let me walk up here a little bit just so you can see this water down here too oh, let me trip i mean let me don't trip and break my neck but look at this this is just it's freaking ridiculous absolutely insane gorgeous All right, I gotta get up to this high point. I'm still like five miles from it, and I keep lollygagging and taking my sweet time. <laughs> Alright, I am over 13,000 feet right now. So, I'm up here. And I can tell because 
breathing sucks right now. It's so hard to breathe. Like, if I start trying to go fast, I get out of breath, I get lightheaded. I just gotta go like really slow, take my time, and get up and over. But this view is, it's pretty amazing. Just met him. He's going that way and I'm going this way. But yeah, man, take it easy. Nice to meet you, ma'am. It's crazy. Every once in a while, like every once in a great while, I run into someone and they're like, hey, aren't you Grizz? I watch your videos. And I'm like, oh, cool. Well, that was cool. I just met him. That's Urgent Cat Hole. And uh, we just talk story for probably like... Look who's up here. Pork special. What's up, man? What's up? I didn't think you'd still be up here. Oh, man, you know I'm at the high point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo. All right, so I'm at the high point here on the Colorado Trail. Um, highest point from Denver to Durango and it's at 13,271 feet check it out yeah and uh, I don't know Ham's trying to get me to hike like another seven miles or something I was planning on three but I don't know what I'm gonna do it all depends on how quickly I can get down this mountain and uh, how cold it gets man because it's freezing right now I'm not really digging it all right, let me get some photos real quick. Then I'm gonna get out of here. I've been showing up here for about 20 minutes with a group of people. And uh, <clears throat> completely forgot to take any footage. So, <clears throat> I'll give you one last look. And I am out of here. Woo! So Ham, AKA Sweet and Sour Pork, decided he's gonna push like another 4.4 up to a lake and camp at a lake because he's gonna try to catch a double stack. But um, that's like another thousand foot climb. And I've already done like 18.4 today. And Tropic just caught up. He's back there somewhere headed this way. Him and I are gonna venture down here towards that tent way off down there in the distance. And we're gonna look for somewhere flat to maybe set up i'm finally home and it's not half bad tropic and i are going to post up right here it's not super level but look at this come on man right kind of have to camp here all right so all set up here you can see and uh, tonight for dinner, we have a Noor's Mexican rice with some chili lime beef jerky in there that is rehydrating and a mini Slim Jim that is chopped up in there. And that's going to be uh, disgustingly delicious. What do you got going on over there, man? Uh, ramen. 
Ooh. I ate a ton of town food, so I'm not too hungry. Mmm, ramen. You guys know how much I love ramen. <laughs> 